Hey, my name is Kitsat One. I weigh 107.1 pounds. That's me. I'm a satellite. My mission was to take pictures of the Korean Peninsula, record audio, then send my findings back to the research lab. You know, when you focus on one place for such a long time, you learn to appreciate certain things. Like steaming hot coffee. People waiting for the bus. And children. It's been 20 years since I was launched. Although I no longer function. I just float aimlessly through space. But all of that was about to change. Because I suddenly heard something that moved me. It was a song. And I felt filled a with warmth. And someone's voice. I want to meet the person with that voice. It turned out for the best. is human, but it is lacking any warmth. Finally got you. There is 
one that annoying incinerator wasn't able to steal from me. I think I lost him. What do we have here? Looks like it's my lucky day. Pretty spry for a cow. No, wait! I'm human! I'm not a cow! Tell me something I don't know. I've heard it before, kid. You got your heart broken, and the next thing you know, you woke up as an animal, is that right? And animal livers are in high demand. Hello, I am Kitsat One. My mission is to collect audio and visual data. Huh? What happened to my body? Detachable arm, stop causing harm. Whither do you roam? Back to your home! Oh. In my efforts to destroy the incinerator, it seems I have created a human girl child. Hmm? What are you? Hmm? I feel violated. Toilet paper? Toilet paper? I am the descendant of fairies, the wizard Merlin. Perhaps you've heard of me. <clears throat> huh, toilet paper talks. I am Kitsat One, but you can call me Cat One. I came to Earth to observe humans. I am a satellite! Strange things are afoot here in the human world, so it is during times of great trials that you will learn what it is to be human. Hey, I hear singing again. It keeps repeating in brief intervals. <laughs> What a strange creature. Perhaps you are the key to the mysterious happenings of this. Seven years old. Male. An aspiring musician. Oh, I'm also currently a whole steam milk cow. I'm here for you. I'll listen to your worries like I know you would for me. Like I know you would for me But the news I hear these days My heart breaks Cause you're not well And I hope that I can help Because I'll always be there for you Oh, I'll be there for you What are you doing? Where the hell is but your head at? Just because you, you made the finals on some TV Idol program, you think you're a pro now? Your song was good. Your performance, I don't think so. You're not connecting with the music. When was the last time you even practiced? Uh, where'd she go? I don't think I have the heart to lie and say that things will be all I don't know if I should stay or if I should let you go. But I hope for the best, for you're not like the rest. I just don't have the heart.
So there you go. That's basically how I became a milk cow. And I've been on the run ever since. Dumb cow, I'm gonna make you pay! Do you require my uh, assistance? Uh, who are you? Ah, yes. I am Merlin, the wizard heir of the fairies. Wow, what toilet paper roll that can talk? No, I'm, just, I'm a wizard. See, what happened was I was taking a nap in a tree that got cut down to create various paper products. That was pretty much on me. Go on, help yourself. It's the good stuff. Two ply. Oh. Oh. A little excessive, don't you think? Oh, this is the good stuff. How fancy. Well, enjoy it. Each of those squares holds some of my magic powers in it. Uh, uh, can I help you? Wait, I live on the second floor. Hello, my name is Kitsat One. My <laughs> mission is... Kitsat One. You may call her Cat One, even though she's really a satellite. Hello, my name is Kitsat One. Satellite? Yeah. She journeyed here from wow. space, guided mm. by the sound of song. Wait, your countenance is familiar. Where do I know you from? Oh my. Stop it! What are you doing? Hmm? Are you really a satellite? You, you seem so human. I can't deal with you. I have my own problems. Oh. Hang on. That's a video of me. Voice is a match. Voice identified. I was drifting aimlessly all alone in space for so long. But after I heard you, I started working again. I would like to get to know you. Where have I seen this cow before? Now think. Oh, yes, I recall now. It was the milk cow that was being chased by the wretched incinerator. That's the one. Huh? Mm -hmm. y you saw that, uh, Mr. Toilet Paper? Hmm? I'm a wizard. I told you five minutes ago. Regardless, this is a stroke of luck. I'll use your bovine presence to snare the incinerator. What say hmm? you, Sir Cow? That fiery beast can be difficult hmm. to locate. The incinerator won't be able about? to resist a creature of your size. But that would mean putting the cow in danger. Oh, heavens! What to do? Hark, milk cow! This shall be for the greater good. Now, once the incinerator has been defeated, the world will return to its rightful balance. Be the bait? For that thing? Th okay, I'm done. Everyone out! I'm not leaving. I fell to Earth so I could meet you. 
Now I need to inform the research lab of my whereabouts. Wait, what? Uh, what are you doing? I have bad reception in here. Uh, Maybe if uh, I point uh, out I don't this need window, any more people knowing about like me. This. Why is she frozen? She breaks down. Time renders all of us useless, and she's quite old. Now's our chance. I'll toss her out. <coughs> Look here, milk cow. If it wasn't for that satellite girl, you wouldn't have gotten away from the incinerator. So how can you in good conscience... <coughs> Ungrateful cow, this is no way to treat your savior. Yeah, well, I never asked her to save me. Hmm? Hmm? My name is Kitsat One. Kitsat One. I was moved by a song, so I followed you to Earth. Don't care. Leave me alone. My name is Kitsat One. Please to meet you. Are you home? Is everything okay? I haven't heard from you in two months, and I heard you haven't been to class. Are you in trouble? Well, whatever's going on, make sure you eat something, okay? You must have been quite the ladies' man. Huh? Unshin. We really need to talk. <gasps> Unshin, I'm you here. Me you can't go. Day? You're a cow. I'll wait for you there until 11. Unshin. <laughs> what does she want to talk about? Uh, it's gonna be 11 soon. Should I go there? What do I wear? <sighs> You do? But only if you allow Cat One and I to stay. Out of the question. No. The incinerator seeks out only those with broken hearts. It'll go to the ends of the earth to find you. I can stop the incinerator and restore balance to this world with your help. Which also means I can help you become human again. So what do you say? Can we stay? Oh. Great, I'll help you. How may I assist? I don't know. First things first, I can't go out like this. Oh. Issue, tissue, paper, joy. Turn this milk cow into a boy. Oh. Oh. I don't believe it. I'm back. I'm human. Oh. 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 What happened? You have a zipper in the back. Look. Huh? It's so uncomfortable, and I can barely breathe in this thing. Ah! Oh no, it's after 11! It's made out of paper, so you must be very careful with it. Why is this girl such a big deal? You know? I first met Unjin five years ago at the freshman party for the Department of Music Composition. I can picture the moment I first saw her so clearly. I even remember the smells in the air. Huh? <laughs> You've had a crush on her for five years, and you've never gotten up the nerve to tell her. But you couldn't stand it if you started dating someone else, could you? You're out of her league. You're not rich and you can't even sing. Besides, who would want to date a milk cow? Uh. Uh. If you tell her how you feel, she'll just reject you. There's no way she'll accept me if she finds out I'm a milk cow. No, I have to see her. Uh. Hey, where'd she go? Are you not meeting her? Mind your own business. I 
I'm sorry, Professor. I'm sure. If you could just give me one more chance, I promise I... Look, I really wish I could. But there are rules in place, and I'm afraid this is just out of my hands. Hey, you all right? I overheard you back there. Yeah. Sucks you missed your tuition deadline, man. So what are you gonna do about it now? Get an extension or... I'll figure it but out. But you've only got a week. <gasps> Don't freak, she's just a toy. <laughs> Didn't I tell you to stay out of trouble? But he grabbed you. I was helping you. The more you help, the more problems you cause. Just leave me alone from now on. Why is he angry? Human emotions are so complicated. These black market guys are always in the sketchiest neighborhoods. <clears throat> you who, Mr. Bjorn, I've got the merchandise. This one's from a zebra. So what's your price? Well, hmm. long time no see, huh? <laughs> How's business going? Uh huh. Honestly, not too great. With that incinerator mucking it up for me. Plenty of broken-hearted out there, but I tell you, it's a race to get their darn livers. This one made me work for it. Dad, have a look. It looks all right. Okay, we got a deal. This sure is a strange world we live in. You just keep them So, uh, who actually buys these things? They sure ain't cheap. <laughs> Misguided rich fools. They think if they eat them, they'll turn human again. <laughs> who knows how these crazy rumors start, eh? Don't know. Don't care. Am I right? Whatever. Just give me that milk cow's liver. Apparently, cow's liver is in demand. Hmm. <laughs> huh? Out of fuel. Uh... Wait, 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 wait! I'd check up on you. Ah. Nice chatting with you. In other news, there was another building collapse. The cause of the collapse is unknown, but it happened in the middle of the night, and police are investigating. Things are getting worse. Uh, it's in the city. The incinerator's closing in on our location. The incinerator's a manifestation of fear. The more fear grows, the more powerful it gets. It targets any and all brokenhearted. It burns them into a pile of ash. If this continues, more and more people will disappear. And before long, all the romantics will be gone. It will destroy the delicate balance of the world. We cannot let this happen. Because I, Merlin... <laughs> Hungry. Why are you staring? Why 
Why does she keep coming back here? Why won't she leave me alone? This is why I don't have roommates. I, I just cleaned that. Stop, stop. What are you doing? Is this it? Hands off! You'll break it! Oh. If you ever touch my keyboard again, I'll kick you out. Got it? Why did he hide the keyboard? Has he stopped singing? <sighs> Finally, some peace and quiet. <clears throat> I should get some rest. <clears throat> Such a foul stench. <clears throat> Much better. Ooh, sleep shall overtake me as the toilet paper holder rocks me in its warm embrace. <clears throat> What's wrong with him now? Why don't you sing? Could you knock? Oh, sorry. See for a moment, you are fine remaining a milk cow. Well, I'm not, you know. Well, there's a witch in the woods who provides shelter for heartbroken animals out of reach of those who wish you harm. You want me to just go live with a strange lady in the woods? The Witch of the North, thank you very much. And I should mention that once you go, you can never regain your human form. Ah, this toilet paper holder is truly exquisite. This any good? I wonder if eating this will recharge me. Are you okay? Did I ask you to eat my food? No. Oh, gross. Huh? Filthy. No, Chew! You in there! Oh, you better either be dead or out delivering pizzas or something! Quick, my human suit! Yes, ma'am, how can I help you? Why didn't you answer the first hundred times I knocked? You enjoy driving me crazy! You have a dog? Oh, and a girl? Mm. I'm gonna have mm -hmm. to charge you more for mm. violating the lease! Yep. Oh. <sighs> Look, I just need a few... Uh -huh. oh! You're not Merlin! I know he's here, so tell that miserable old fart to come outside at once! I almost broke my back in half looking for him. And the air's so dirty here, how do you breathe? This is why wizards move to the countryside! Who are you? Merlin, I tire of your games! <laughs> Show yourself! And who are you? You know what, never mind. Ugh, I'm already getting claustrophobic in this tiny shack, and I've only been here 30 seconds. Ugh, time to pull out the big guns. Sniff him out, my darlings! Come on, we haven't got all day! Yes, yes, in every nook and cranny. Why don't you do your dishes once in a while? Do you smell something, my dears? Ah, I knew it! So, that's where you're been hiding! Well, this is embarrassing. Ah, Merlin, <laughs> you old bat! <laughs> Out of the question, you can't take him. Milk Cow is the only one able to defeat the incinerator and save humanity since I'm currently toilet paper. Ah, that's your genius plan. Please tell me you're joking. In the meantime, more brokenhearted will die. They'll be safer with me. If we get rid of the incinerator, all the animal turned humans can come back. That thing won't rest until he gets milk cow. Let's use that to our advantage. <laughs> and what are you gonna do? Wipe the incinerator's bottom? Uh, I'll have you know I'm working on restoring my powers, so there. Hmm. Your magic cane would come in handy right about now. Without that, you're less of a wizard and more just a sewer clog waiting to happen. Oh, I have it. Wait, you're joking, right? That was my enchanted staff. 
<laughs> the only thing you'll be enchanting is a bowl of kimchi. Oh, that's rich. Anyway, I have to take another batch of broken hearted to the woods. But Milk Cow, he can't go. He still has traces of his heart. Don't worry, dear. It'll soon disappear as mine did. But that one, now she's a mystery. I can't even tell if she's got a heart. It was an accident. Hmm. I turned a passing satellite into a human. I'm sorry, come again? She's a satellite? How come she has no scent? You can't just go around sniffing people like that, Grandma. Grandma? Does this couture scream Grandma to you? If you apologize for your impertinence and meet me at the playground in the next few days, I'll take you with me. That's my offer. Take it or leave it. Huh? <sighs> Can't get any worse. Great. Totally broke. Uh, guess it can get worse. Plus, I lost my job. Huh? Oh, of course. No, 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 no. There. I did my best. This would barely cover a child's cereal. This will take forever. I will help you. But wait. Toilet paper shouldn't get wet. Cat one, you must do it. Me? <gasps> okay. No way. I don't need your help. I got it. I got it. I said I could do it by myself. <gasps> we just pour it into milk cartons. You heard the girl. <laughs> yes, you. Oh, bag. Milk for sale. Fresh and delicious milk for sale. Milk for sale. Huh? Fresh and delicious milk for sale. Oh, is it organic? Tasty organic. Oh, oh, look at you. I heard organic milk. Yeah, yeah. 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 Me too. Are you all right? <sighs> wow, we made a lot. At least it looks like a lot. You know what? Let me count it. <laughs> <Huh>? <laughs> Forty thousand won short. I'll be back later. <sighs> Sleeping like a baby. <laughs> quietly, quietly. <sighs> Crazy plunger guy! What do you want from me? Isn't it obvious? What else are plungers for? I want that liver! <laughs> Wait! Don't I need my liver to live or something? That is an excellent question. You will find out in a moment. One. Wow, two. Your lady took all our. Uh, hey, what are you doing to Kyum Chun? Uh, nothing. Kim just help! He's trying uh, to kill me. We just roughhousing. <laughs> I've heard of liver poachers targeting broken-hearted. The question is why. Uh, seriously? Uh, you're choking me. Let me go. Wait, 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 wait. don't let me go. Leave Young alone. Is that chip a rocket? How does a cow have a bodyguard? Hey. It's really beautiful out here. Just curious. How did you like that song I wrote? Huh? Oh! I loved it. I made that song for you. Ching Chung? 
Uh, hey, so I have something to tell you. Okay. I met someone I like, and I figured I should probably tell you. Oh, is it that guy? The one who came to my gig? You saw him? Yeah, that's the one. What is he, a neurosurgeon? Or CEO? At least he can provide for you. Buy you gifts and stuff. It's not like that, Kim Chun. Sure it is. I mean, I get it. Girls are into that kind of stuff. Smart, rich, and steadily employed. Actually, he's another musician. Oh. And I guess he's not as conventionally attractive or talented as you. But he... he has a heart like no one I've ever met. He makes me very happy. You can't be serious! You change boyfriends like you change your clothes. This time won't be any different. It is. We're going to get married. Uh, you, you, if you were interested in other guys, why did you keep hanging out with me? Are you kidding me? Uh, don't tell me you didn't know how I felt. Were you just leading me on? It's not like that. I've treasured our friendship these past five years. Trust me, it wasn't my intention to hurt you. I know you'll find someone that makes you this happy, too. You'll find someone? Do you know what happened when you broke my heart? I turned into a milk cow! You're more selfish than I thought. What a childish prank. I'm so disappointed. Why are you adorning your face like that? You know that girl, Yunjin? Uh, the pretty one? <laughs> I guess. If you find long hair and a symmetrical face pretty. You don't take this the wrong way, but that shade is hideous. <sighs> Enough! I thought I was just being honest. <laughs> okay, no more. Bye bye. <laughs> At Naro Space Center in Gohyun County, South Kyoto, the preparation for tomorrow's launching of KitSat 5 is underway. Since 1992, Korea's space development efforts have faced one setback after another. And now, to tell us a little more about that troubled history, Kim Ji Soo. In August of 1992, KitSat 1 was launched from the Guiana Space Center in South America. Hey. That's me. That one was the first Korean built satellite. Am I up there? The country's Drifting in space? The roster of satellite destinations. Unfortunately, the satellite <gasps> has since stopped working. And there's been no new communication since 2004. That's strange. I can't move my arm anymore. What have I done? Maybe I was better off drifting in space. What am I? Should I return to space? Is it even possible to go back? Think you're going, young lady? This place is off limits to the public. Sir, I am Cat One, Kitsat One, the satellite they showed on TV. Uh. I'm broken and floating in space. I mean, I was, but oh. not anymore. Uh, I have to let them know that I'm here. What on earth are you talking about? Uh, Go home and uh, uh, I don't know, uh, read a book. Fly outside. Stop watching so many cartoons. Uh, Kit, she's a stinking satellite. Her parents probably don't hug her enough. Well, she's crazy. A boat. My mission seems to have been for nothing. 
Nobody cares about what a satellite feels. Young Chun's song was the only thing that moved me. But now I'm breaking down and soon I'll stop working. Could you stop breathing on me, please? Yoho seems kind of out of it today. Almost sad. I wonder, can satellites get depressed too? What's wrong? Are you okay? Can you charge me? Charge you? Yeah, there's a cord in my back. Oh, you weren't kidding. Go the lights! Uh Well, I definitely felt that. Oh, you mean the electricity? I felt it too when you reached out to touch me just now. Huh. And when I heard your beautiful song from space. <clears throat> so, did you make contact with those space guys or whatever? No one believes me. They think that I'm still broken and drifting in space. Have you been to space? Huh? Like space space? Is that even possible? Huh? What's that? Is something wrong? Uh, oh, um, it's nothing, really. I wouldn't worry about it if I were you. Can you just pull out the cord for me? Mm. me what are you doing out here here I picked these myself they're for you well how'd you know I like the balloon flower I'm not just a cow you know
Kyung Chun, how would you feel if I were to one day just suddenly disappear? I don't know. I guess I haven't thought about it. I see. Because I was... <gasps> Nice dropping me like that. Ruined my whole night. It's about to get worse. Not bad. Take this and this. off me. We've lost him. Oh no, he's in the mirror! The mirror! Let me do my stinking job! Will I be stuck as a milk cow forever? myself there for you <laughs> there that's got to be at least a month's worth of arms go with you I have to give up everything I have here right yes that's correct but what does that matter wouldn't it be better to come live in the forest with me far away from danger surrounded by others like yourself no incinerators no mr. O's hunting you down trying to steal your liver is it because of that girl the one who lives with you 
Uh, no, why would you say that? She's my friend. Besides, it would never work. A satellite. And a hey, dumb milk cow! What are you yelling at me for? Plus, she's not even my type. I, I guess sometimes I feel a small something for her. But maybe that's a side effect of turning into a milk cow. Or it could be I'm just lonely after getting dumped. Anyway, me and Cat? <laughs> no way. If you truly don't have feelings for her, then stop leading her on and let her go. Except I can't do that. When I'm with Cat One, I become the best version of myself. She makes me feel like singing again. And like, whatever I want to do, I can as long as she's beside me. <sighs> I'm a bad person, aren't I? No, just selfish. And a fool. Maybe that's why you became a milk cow. The cow word became a cow. I'd say you got what you deserved. I have no idea what I should do. Ugh. Sounds like a personal problem. Anyway, I must be going. Have a nice life! Witch of the North! Wait, hold oh, on a sec! You've made your bed! Now lie in it! <laughs> what should I do? Why couldn't I have just been a normal girl? I wish that I had just stayed in space and never come down here. Because then I wouldn't have met you. And my heart wouldn't hurt like this. Thank you. You're a lot less scary than you look. <laughs> Where she is. Is that you, Catwa? Where were you all night? You had me worried sick about you. Why do you care huh? about what happens to me anyway? I don't know why it concern you. I'm nothing to you, remember? You know what? You're right! You in fact, you're less than nothing to me! Just forget what? I said anything in the first Come place, now. all right? What is going on with the both of you? Well, I guess it's best if we just go our separate ways then. Fine, whatever. What has gotten into well, you? What are you waiting for? Go! <laughs> Milk cow, my friend. Let's talk about this. Why don't you just go back to space? Ah! <laughs> They've gone mad, raving mad. You're really leaving? Don't you care what happens to me? Would you stop following me? Okay, have it your way.
want that leather, don't you? Of course. Why? Huh? This kid sat one, ran out of fuel, broke down, came to Earth, and... Wait, you're telling me the kid's a satellite? Explains a lot. Exactly, and I have an idea. We can kill two birds with one stone. Oh, man, that right there sounds like music to my ears. Can't wait to hear what tricks you got up your sleeve this time. Uh, why are you looking at me like that? Uh, oh, I'm not. Could this be the glow you see when you fall in love? There it is! See? You're doing it again! No, it's just that your face is kind of glowing. Oh, sorry. I must have left the gas light on. My face lights up when I do that. Am I still glowing now? N no, no, not anymore. And you're all filled up. Woo! <laughs> oh, come on. What's taking her so long? What's she even doing in a restroom? This is so awkward. Huh? Huh? Mister, you have a tail. Pretty tail. <laughs> ah! My human suit. <laughs> it's a milk cow. Shh. What are you doing? Uh. Come here. No. You get no, away! No, ma'am, I, I... Help! I, I it's just, a monster! Hey, hey, what's going on? Did you hear a scream over there? It's coming from the playground. My goodness! What's that? All right, oh, okay. Put out your hoods. A safe neighborhood. A monster preying on he children. He tried to run off with my daughter. We'll Isn't get this thing off the street. This even has a tail. You were All right, right everybody. Oh, oh, these oh, cops aren't even doing their job. Please, let him go! Are you saying this monster belongs to you? He's not a monster. He's human. He can even talk. Go on, say something. That thing is a monster. That's what I said. We can't really take our kids anywhere these days. It's not safe out here anymore. Whatever it is, it needs to be put down. No? Yeah, that's right. Kelly, come get away. What are you doing? Hey, wait. You can't do that, miss. What is going on in this town? Whoa. 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 Is she some kind of I don't know what she is. Don't worry about her right now. It's the monster we should be more concerned with. Look, over there. He's trying to hide in those bushes. Officer, Excuse why are you just standing there? Deer? Don't you have a gun or something? Go! It's a ghost! satellite. Cap 1 is a satellite. But why does my heart pound like this? It's weird. Really weird. It's not like anything I've ever felt before. Do you want to go to the Han River tomorrow? The Han River? Why? The weather is nice, so... I thought... I don't really have anything to wear. I could buy you some clothes. Come on. Cat one? Huh? I, uh... One, look. No matter what, I'll never let go of your hand. Here. Uh, would you 
wait here for a second? Oh, where are you going? I finally found you. <laughs> Why are you here? Whoa, hold on there. You know, you two look great together. I'm envious. I've seen a lot of couples, but I know you two are gonna go the distance. <laughs> That's all I came to say. Stop lying. You're only here for his <laughs> liver. Well, she gets straight to the point. Look, either I'll get him, or the incinerator will. I can save him. <laughs> Looks like you don't have much time left. Sure, you're still able to protect him now, what about later? You'll be out of juice. And the milk cow is as good as dead. So why don't we eliminate the incinerator together? After that, I'll stop hunting milk cow. My business tanked after the incinerator came on the scene. Hey, everybody's got to eat, right? Uh, I'll think about it. Hey, swell. Glad we could work out this little arrangement. Yeah, I'll be in touch. See you later, okay? Didn't even say goodbye. <laughs> Nailed it! Satellites are so gullible, she fell for it. After I get rid of her, that milk cow's liver is mine. <laughs> I'm so happy I can squeal like a little girl! Kyung Chun can't keep running forever. If I help that man take down the incinerator, can I trust that he'll keep his promise? I'm running out of power. I won't be able to keep him safe much longer. My battery won't recharge anymore. If I'm not here, Kim Chun will. Huh? Huh? You shouldn't be outside. Oh. It's dangerous. Count one. Are you free right now? me do you like me <laughs> be serious Kyung Chun you know deep down we can never be together right Satellite. Do you still like me now? Yeah. My arm is a projectile. And my head. Do you still like me? Yeah. I still like you. You really don't get it, do you? Are you not going somewhere? Uh, 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 come on, what... What were you doing? Uh, might I inquire as to where exactly you're headed with all that? Don't worry about it. Thanks for everything, Merlin. Take care of Kyung Chun for me. What's gotten into her? Uh, uh, she likes me. She likes me. Uh, she likes me. She likes me not. She likes me. She likes me not. She likes me. 
if Cap One doesn't like me back? I should have been better to her. Cap One? Where are you going? I'm leaving now. Cat One, I... I promise you... Young Chun, why are you out here? I told you to stay inside. I have a gig today. I'm returning to music. Will you come? Having a heart, being a human, feeling your heart flutter, feeling it break, it's all so much. You are milk cow. I mean, Jung Chung. Uh, Merlin, Black Dog, you're here for my show? 
milk cow, something terrible has happened. Cat One went to destroy the incinerator by herself. I don't know where they are, but I know this. She's running out of strength, and she's going to die. We have to save her! Cat One, where are you? I'm gonna need a hand with this. Cat One came to me after hearing my song. Maybe it'll work again. Cat One, wherever you are, I hope this reaches you. Suddenly you came into this world. Whoa, where's that music coming from? Hey, hold on a second. That's not yours. Young man, what do you think you're doing up there? Please be quiet. Can't you see At the tall closed door of steel? Feeling so surreal. Holding your breath all alone as you try to move on. Suddenly you came into this world. Well, I guess if magic existed. It makes sense that it would be music. A universal language transcending time and place, speaking straight to the heart. Even though we were light years apart, music brought us together. Time? I'm sorry. Did you think you suddenly made the piano take flight? I'm out of magic. Oh, oh, only you can destroy the incinerator! Oh, save Merlin. Cat One! Merlin! Incinerator! Cat <laughs> One, where are you? Do now. Be not afraid, my friend. Merlin, are, is that is that you? This is my true form. Do not let fear imprison you. You must face the darkness if you ever want to see the light again. That's the only way for you to fully become human. Now run. <laughs> Cat one. Where are you? Can you hear me? Cat One! Cat One, speak to me. Cat One. Yang Chen, I heard your beautiful song.
pay the gas bill, but it's okay. I'm making you some ramen. My name is Kitsat One. My mission was to take pictures of the Korean Peninsula, record audio, then send them back to the research lab. I did end up sending something back to them. This was my message. Even